Hey cute people. Yeah, I'm doing another haul video. I know I just did a haul video. The very last video I did. How about the one before that? Was that a haul video? I can't remember. I can't remember. I told you guys that doing haul videos for me are the most easiest to do. And then I like haul videos. And I like watching haul videos. Because I figured with the haul video you can see what's on sale. Um, pick up something or look at something that you may be interested in. You know, I'm sharing something, you know, with you guys. But I'm going to go through this video really quickly only because I have quite a lot of things I want to show you guys. And I can talk a lot. So I'm going to try to move through it really, really quickly so I can show you everything I have. And this is not everything I have, but this is most of the stuff that I did purchase. And I purchased this before Black Friday, Cyber Monday, Small Business Saturday, all that I Got all this stuff before then. Um, to tell you the truth, I think a lot of this stuff I probably purchased in late October. Yeah. And like I usually do, I, I, I buy it or it comes in um, delivered. And I look at it and I put it away and then I just leave it there. But the reason why I'm going to show you these things now is because I made a commitment to myself. And I really, really think I can stick with it. Because there's only three other palettes that I want. And that's the Naked 2, the Naked 3. And the honey palette. Other than that, there's no other foundations I want to try. Well, that's not really true. But, I mean, they're not things that I have to have. Because, again, I won't even go through all that. But, yeah, those are the only three things that I want to get. I know I missed the Naked 3, which was on sale recently everywhere. Half price. But that's okay. And I'm hoping that everything that I want to purchase, I will get it within 2019. Because... 2020, I'm going to be on a very low no-buy. I'm going to call it a low no-buy only because if those three things that I want come up um, at a great price, then I'm going to buy it. But let me just show you what I got. Let me just show you what I got. All right, so one of the places that I shopped at um, was NYX. And at that time, NYX had a sale. And the sale was... 20% off, I believe. I think for Black Friday, they had 40% off. So I was like, eh. But you know, my money was right. So I went on and got it. And I picked up just four things. I wanted to buy more, but I stopped myself. One of the things that I wanted to try for the longest time were their setting sprays. So I got the Dewey setting spray. And this is good. I think that says, oh goodness, I can't even read that small writing. Either 48 months, I think. But I picked this up here. And I just want to smell it. Let me see what it smells like. Okay, it doesn't smell like alcohol or anything. So that's not too bad. Because I have dry skin. So I wanted to try the Dewey Setting Spray. I picked this up because I wanted to show support for Alyssa Ashley. And I hope I'm saying her name right. And it's the NYX can't stop won't stop i wanted to purchase this when it first came out but i was on one of those i can't buy another foundation until i use up a foundation and yeah i'm gonna leave that video up here so that you can watch it and it's just my north carolina stash makeup that i had foundations that i had um here so i wasn't supposed to purchase one i think i used up one foundation and since then, I purchased three or four, and I'm waiting for three more. Oh, it's a shame. It's a mess. I didn't stick to it, but here's the foundation. And I picked up the color Cappuccino, and it's a glass bottle, and it does have a pump. Can you see? It does have a pump. And I said, oh, well, I'll go ahead and try it. This is a full coverage foundation, which I don't really have a lot of full coverage, but I have one now. I also picked up the Can't Stop, Won't Stop contour concealer is what they call it and i picked this up in the color golden which you probably can't see but i picked this up in golden and here is pretty much what it looks like and i just wanted to try it with the um foundation so i have this now and i don't think i need to be buying any more found um well foundations and concealers but Another thing I picked up because I'm always going through with my eyebrows. I had not too long ago posted a video that I did not like my eyebrows, but I posted the video anyway. But before I did this video, I did a nose check and a lip check because I told you guys my lips chat because of B12 deficiency and so forth. And then my nose always running, so I had to make sure everything was right, which I hope it is because if it is fantastic if it is not too bad because this video is going up anyway i'm old enough to realize um everything a ain't perfect and b 
I ain't got to be perfect all the time. But anyway, so I picked up this um, eyebrow powder pencil only because I wanted a pencil instead of a twist up. Because the twist ups are really great for me because, you know, I don't have any eyebrows. But, um, you know, after a while those things break and then a lot of the product is down here in the bottom and you can't get it and all that. So I said, let me just go back to a pencil. Then it has a spoolie on it. And I got this in the color espresso. I want to see if this color is true to the cap. Let's see. It looks, okay, it looks a little bit dark than the cap I think and pretty no pretty much the same okay this is what I got and I don't know if this is the darkest one after black but I didn't want black of course I can't use black but I figured I'll try that now the next thing I picked up is something that I wanted to try but I said no I'm not gonna get it because I was on that I have to use up a foundation before I buy a foundation but I didn't stick to it and I picked up the Juvia's Place I Am Magic foundation this foundation at the time was on sale well at one time and I think it may be on sale now but at one time it was on sale um, on the website and I missed the sale so when I was able to get a coupon that would allow me to make this purchase from Ulta and get it almost at the same price I said hey I may as well go ahead and get it and I got the color logos you probably wouldn't be able to see it but this is the one that I picked up and I'm really curious to use this foundation because it's radiant long-lasting creamy and comfortable and I did make a purchase with Juvia's Place for Black Friday and um, it's like taking forever to get here it's gonna take almost a whole nother week and they just shipped it and I think I ordered it two weeks ago something like that okay now I was on my way out of Ulta and I stopped and I looked at some sign they had at the door and I went back in and I made a purchase and this is what I picked up they were on sale it was either 40 percent 50 percent or 60 percent I don't know it was some great price so I went on and got it and if you know anything about Ulta and BH Cosmetics at that time you know how long I've had these palettes and nope put it down and never looked at it again St. Tropez okay summer in St. Tropez this is this palette here, which I'm going to show you because, as you can see, it looks like it probably was a summer debut, I'm going to say. It has the umbrellas here. Really pretty package. And here is the palette. Now, look at that palette. Isn't that palette beautiful? I mean, these colors here these colors here these two here that one there oh that one this whole palette yes this whole palette is gorgeous 16 beautiful colors that i cannot wait to use um and hopefully y'all will soon because i need to and these um colors in the pan it has the name so you can see the name there okay you see well, the name is listed there, so if you had the palette or wanted to tell someone what you had on your eyes, you'd be able to. And I think this palette is really, really pretty. I wish I could remember how much I paid for it, but like I said, for me, it was a great price. And it had some other, like two others, but these are the two that I picked. I believe I wanted the other two also, but I said, let me just get these two and get out of here. And this one here is beautiful in Barcelona. Yeah, and this one has 16 shadows also, as you can see. Here's the package. Really pretty. Really, really pretty. And here is the palette. Gorgeous. Really, really pretty. The other palette, I think, is perfect for summer. And this one here is perfect for the winter. And you really can use these palettes anytime you want. But I just think the color story, being that the shadows are pretty much dark, you use them in the summer, winter time, winter time. But all these colors, beautiful, gorgeous. And I can tell you for sure the price was right um, up my alley. So I picked these two things up. And then, you know, the strangest thing, um, Fenty Beauty had a sale. I believe this sale here was 20% off. I noticed for Black Friday, there wasn't an actual sale, so to speak, but a lot of... Um, uh, what can I say, debuts and gift set purchases or 
discounted prices or whatever. I don't know. But I was thinking maybe she would do 20%, 30%, or 40% or something. But she did not. I guess she doesn't have to because we're going to buy her stuff anyway. I won't be buying much unless it's on sale. But I did pick up two items. And one thing I can say about her packaging is really, really pretty. Now, the box itself was just a plain old brown box. But then when you open up the box, look at that. Really, really pretty. It came in this black wrap that says Fenty Beauty. And then the box itself back here. Isn't that nice? Nice added touch. For me to be, to be honest, for me, packaging does not mean much of anything. You don't have to give me a whole bunch of fun, fancy packaging. Just give me some pretty product and I'm, I'm fine. But I still thought that was really nice. Okay, so I just picked up two things. Again, here I go with the foundations. Why? I don't know. But I know I need to chill with them because I don't need all these foundations. Okay. So I picked up the Pro Filter Hydrate and Longwear Foundation. Here's the box. And if you watch my video, you know I'll have this box damn near forever. So this is the foundation, Fenty Beauty. Hold on, let's go to your right way. Fenty Beauty. And I picked up the color 420. That's my color. And here's the foundation. Yeah, I think it's going to be a hit and it has a pump and I'm sure if you Watching um, YouTube videos here, you know what this foundation is about and I have got to be Using it soon or I'm going to drive myself crazy because now I have a renewed interest in it then I picked up the um, mini instant retouch setting powder because I see here YouTube definitely made me buy this because people always say that the um, powder is finely mailed. Now one thing that disappointed me is that um, the banana shade was sold out and here it is the pretty pretty packaging really really gorgeous take off the top and and I, I and I know this here regular price is eighteen dollars I believe little pad yeah it's so cute and then here is the now me I got this in nutmeg not what I wanted but I really wanted to try the powder so I picked this up here and so I got those two items from Fenty Beauty and like I mentioned to you they were on. Sale. I think it was 20% off. That was the sale that I caught that day. Which, correct me if I'm wrong, it doesn't seem like she has a lot of sales on her site, but hey. Okay, so now the next items that I'm going to show you are some that I'm really excited about because I am. And that's from Perfusion. Can you see that? Perfusion. And one thing I can say, I like this black box. Yeah, I can't wait to throw it away. But I like this black box, y'all. This black box is really, really nice. And look at the other side here. Perfusion Cosmetics. So, you know what's coming to your house when you see this box. But anyway, I got a few things because I like Perfusion. And when it comes to perfusion, the price is right. But if you can get a sale, it's always better. So you know I got a sale. On the email that was sent, it said that they were giving you 15% off. But I searched for a promo code and got lucky and found 20% off. So I got these things for 20% off. So let me share with you what I got. And... Profusion is a company that I would like to buy a lot more of their eyeshadow palettes. I'm not sure if I want to buy anything else, but I ain't, so it doesn't matter. Then they send you a little card, inspiring the aspiring artist, yeah. So I got five different items. The first I'm going to show you is the blush palette. Here's what it looks like, really, really cute. And that's plastic, but here is the shadows. Yeah. 
And I really got it because I was in love with this color here more than anything. I don't know if they sell single shadows, but I was in love with this color right here. And the rest of them, I'm not too sure about how I'm going to feel about it. But the regular price was $5.99 and then on sale, 20% off. What is that about? Um, Two, three dollars off. So I got the palette. Really, really cute. And then I also picked up this palette here, which I thought was so pretty. This is the Metallics palette. I must have seen someone do um, a video. Um, a makeup look with this because I said, who? And, and if you look at the colors, the colors are just gorgeous. I mean, but then when you think about it, at least when I do, I'm like, how many different colors of blue do I really need? And then I answer myself and say, as many as you can buy. Duh. But listen, y'all, it comes with a little brush, which does say profusion on it. Mm -hmm, that's cute. And here is the palette. I mean, look at those shades. They are so gorgeous. This is 24 metallic shades, and they are so, so pretty. Yeah. If you go onto the website and you look at some of these palettes, I, um, some people have submitted some of their looks. Maybe that's where I could have seen it at, but the looks that they submit are really, really pretty. So, when... Profusion has another sale. You better jump on it. I'm not, though. This is the Festival palette here. Let me open it up here. Okay. And this here has, I believe, 35 shades. No brush. And it has the little classic on top with the names of the shadows. Again, this is the Festival palette. And here is what the Festival palette looks like. Really, really pretty. Isn't it pretty? Yeah. Let me move on because I want to show you two other palettes. And I don't want to keep you that long this evening. And this is the Mirage palette. Let me show you. But I just want to show you. It says Mirage. So if you're looking for it in the store, you know what to look for. And here is the palette. And this also has um, a plastic cover with the names on it. Let me see if I can lift it up so I can show you the colors oh my goodness my fingers how do i get this thing off i mean all right it's gonna take a second all right here we go and the plastic has the names on them and this one here in the back it also has the names of the colors but look at the colors look look at the colors and on the back there's the name so if you didn't want to keep the sheet for this one here See the names. You have it on the back in case you want to tell somebody what's on your eyes. But there it is. And then um, the Festival palette has the back, the names on the back also. But the Metallic palette does not. The um, Blush palette does not have any names on it either. And I have one more palette to show you. And then we can say ta-ta. Now this palette here really makes me think of Paradise. Yeah, it's a pro pigment palette. They're all a pro pigments. And here is the Paradise palette. Just want to show you. And this one here also has the name of the shadows on the sheet there. But the names are not on the back. Yeah, no names. So let me pull up this here so you can see what it looks like without the plastic on it. And here is the Paradise palette. Tell me that palette isn't pretty. Oh my goodness, look at all those pretty purples, the blues, the greens. It's just a pretty nice palette. 35 shades for you to enjoy. Now I know I moved through it kind of quickly, but I didn't want to keep you guys too long. I knew I had quite a bit of things that I wanted to show you guys. Sorry I couldn't sample anything. Um, well, not that I couldn't, I just didn't, I just didn't do it. I know, it's a shame. I'm, I'm terrible. But I just wanted to show you guys the things that I picked up before Black Friday. And like I said, I'm waiting for some stuff that I ordered on Black Friday that's, um, 
Julia's place, and then I ordered some stuff from Shop Miss A, my first Shop Miss A haul, and I'm really excited to see what those things are about. And like I mentioned, after that, pretty much, yeah. But I did pick up some other stuff, too, and I put it <laughs> in the back over there. <laughs> so when I get a chance, I'll take a look at it. And if I get a chance, I'll show you guys. But listen, I'm going to end this video now. I didn't ask you at the beginning of the video to subscribe to my channel, but I'm going to ask you now. Subscribe to my channel for, for more me. Hopefully you do. And I do want to say that I will greatly appreciate it. I mean, what does it cost you to subscribe? Nothing, but you get to see more, more of me. Yeah, and holes and more holes and a whole lot of holes. But anyway, listen, um, like I mentioned, I'm going to end this video now. I'm not sure what time it is. It's not very late in the evening, but I do want to get something to drink. Yeah. And as you can see, I haven't done a thing to my hair. This is my Dollar Tree scarf, and I just plopped it on my head. Yeah, with my earrings. But anyway, yeah. So I'm going to end this video now, and I just want to say thank you so much for stopping by and watching this video. And hopefully, I'll see you in the next. Oh, yeah. I was supposed to say share and spread love, and then blow the kiss right i'm moving a little ahead of myself because i'm thirsty all right so share and spread love share and spread love